This weekend, I'm swinging, swinging to the fences, and either I'll be really happy or I'll kind of be disappointed, but I am making some pretty crazy ass decisions. Chase, we got here with the Blue Food Tongue going to the box office prediction from the 24th to the 26th of May. And since this is Memorial Day weekend, I'm still only doing Friday to Sunday. So there is that. Okay, let's talk about the three movies that are coming out that I kind of see that's coming out. Sight, Furiosa, Garfield the film. Right, let's talk about Sight first. That is the Angel Studios new film that was supposed to come out, I think, like three or four months ago. But it's finally coming out Memorial Day weekend. I think it'll be cool or an interesting true story. Pretty simple. All right. Garfield and Furiosa. Of course, Furiosa is the Mad Max sequel, the fifth one to it. Uh, you've seen a lot of trailers for this. It premiered at Con, Can, Con, whatever, the French area. But uh, I think it did pretty good overall. I don't think it's doing as good as, you know, the first one. But people are saying the story's not as good. But when you watch all the other Mad Max stories or movies, do you really go in for the story? Not really. So there is that. Then you have the Garfield film. All right. Apparently, the critics aren't liking it this month much. And I'm intrigued because let's just talk about what predictions are saying. A lot more people are saying Furiosa is going to do better than Garfield. Let's just hold it there. And let's continue on with how I did last weekend and continue this conversation later. All right. How I did last weekend? I actually did really freaking good. Except the five spot. And I think a lot of people failed at the five spot. Are you ready, Mark? Because number five was actually Challengers with 2.8. You heard it right. Back to Black couldn't even make it in the top five. It made number six so with 2.8. I want to say it was about a $17,000 difference. That is it from Back to Black and Challengers. But I was wrong. I was thinking Back to Black would be 2.8. It was 2.8. I was thinking 6 million. I suck. Yawn coming. Anyway, uh, 4 it was actually the fall guy. I was thinking 8.5. It was 8.3. Thumbs up uh, for this guy. All right. And number 3 was the Strangers Chapter 1. I was thinking 10 million. It was 11.8. I wasn't in that 1 million range. It is what it is. Sucks to suck for this guy. Number 2 was Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes. I was thinking 25.8. It was 25.4. I was in that million range. Shaka bra. And then number one was if, and I was guessing 33.3-ish. It was 33.7. I was only 0.4 off. Hell yeah, brother. I wasn't expecting to do that good for that one because everyone's thinking it's going to be above 40. Wasn't feeling it, but I'm glad I got that in that same range. Okay. I do think this weekend, that's what I'm saying. I'm going balls to the wall. But with it being a weekend where kids are finally out of school, ooh, Memorial Day weekend, I anything could go. I truly think anything could go. But for number five, I, it's a tie for me between Fall Guy and Strangers Chapter 1. But I think I'm going to give the edge to Strangers Chapter 1. I'm going with $5 million. But if you see me change this Thursday night... Don't blame me. I'm warning you right now. I could change to the Fall Guy just because I think more families are going to want to go see the Fall Guy instead of, of course, Strangers Chapter 1. And I think Strangers Chapter 1 does have a significant drop ahead of it, but I could be wrong. So we're going to stick with Strangers right now. Number four, I'm going with Planet of the Apes. Oh my God. With 14, uh, 14 million. Um... This has got me curious because I'm intrigued what the drop is going to be for If. Um, it's not really a kid's movie that people thought it was going to be. And of course, Garfield's coming out. But Planet of the Apes has competition with Fall Guy, with Furiosa. So, I don't know. And I do think Planet of the Apes is going to lose a couple screens to Furiosa. So that's why I think that's going to stick right there. So that's why I'm going to have number three be if with 15.5. That's why there's pretty close, only a million point two dollar difference. But I do think if will, you know, just barely beat out Planet of the Apes with 15.2. But I could be wrong because you know what? Garfield could take a lot. All right. Like I said in the beginning, 
a lot of people have Furiosa over Garfield. I could see that. Mad Max Fury Road did about $45 million. But Garfield, the last time there was an animated film, was Kung Fu Panda 4, and that was in March. Add that to schools out. And it has me thinking. So my number two is Furiosa with fifty million. I do think it'll do a little bit better than Fury Road. You know, even though that came out in two thousand sixteen, I want to say it did forty five million. I'm going fifty million. Again, this is on Tuesday night. I could change this when Thursday night comes, but I'm keeping Furiosa at fifty million, and that puts number one Garfield at fifty five million. This is where I'm swinging to the fences. If Kung Fu Panda on a march, yes, IP, but of course Garfield has a lot of IP too, you know, to it. Um, 57 million for Kung Fu Panda 4. I fucked that up last time I did it. Garfield, 55 million. Like I said, it's hard for me to put Furiosa above Garfield. It truly is just because, like I said, it's a cartoon. Kids are out. Kids Adults are going to want to bring their kids to a movie. And I think this is an option. But I could be wrong. Like I said. And people are saying. Oh pre-sale tickets. Garfield's cartoons don't pre-sale. Especially this one. Maybe Inside Out 2 would. But I just don't see Garfield having the pre-sale tickets. But I think family's going to flood to it. I don't know though. This is just my gut feeling on a Tuesday night. It could change. But my initial reactions are. Strangers Chapter 1, 5 million. 4, Plan of the Apes, 14 million. If at number 3 with 15.2, Furiosa, number 2 at 50 million, Garfield, the movie at 55 million. Am I wrong? Probably this weekend, but let's have some fun. Chase Zach here at the Blue Futon. Like, comment, subscribe. One of the things, Blue Futon Topia. You Blue Futon, stay watch a great down. Watch the state tomorrow, week from now, month, and a year from now, every single freaking one of you. Oof, I'm swinging. And I'm probably going to miss. Batting average is going to suck.